We're going to talk about join and share settings, which are the most foundational part of using Firefly. This will determine which meetings that the Firefly's AI note taker bot joins, as well as who it sends the meeting recaps to afterwards. Uh, it'll also be the first screen that you see when you're signing up. It'll tell you to review your settings. It'll ask which meetings would you like Fireflies to join by default. You can have it set to join all calendar events with a web conferencing link. What I mean by that is if there is a calendar invite where there's a meeting conference URL uh, for a platform that Firefly support. We support several different video conferencing providers, including Zoom, Google Meet, WebEx, Microsoft Teams, etc. So when you say join all calendar events with a web conferencing link, Fireflies will look at your calendar events and see if uh, there's a video conferencing link and then join those meetings. You can have it only join calendar events where you're the host or the owner of that. So that's the second option. There's a third option where Fireflies would not join unless you explicitly invite Fred at Fireflies.ai as a participant. So it would not auto join. You would have to invite Fred at Fireflies as a participant. Now, if you join with a corporate domain, you'll get two other uh, options as well. So for example, if I sign up with Bob at Tesla.com, one of the options will be join only internal meetings with other teammates. What this will do is it'll join meetings where all the participants are from Tesla.com. The next option, the fifth option, will be join only external meetings. So any calendar invite where the participants are different where the participants are anyone other than uh, folks from tesla.com, then Fireflies would join those meetings. This is great if you're having customer or client facing meetings that you would want Fireflies to join, right? Now, this option right here, send recaps to, will determine who gets the meeting recaps afterwards. And that is based on the participants list. Uh, so you'll have the list of participants on the calendar invite. So Fireflies can send recaps to everyone on the invite, or you can have it send recaps only to you. You can have it send recaps to only folks that are uh, from my company, right? So there's multiple options on who you can send the re recaps to. And it is based on the folks or the participants on the calendar invite. That's the basic foundation to getting Fireflies to join your meetings uh, and determining how the recaps get sent afterwards. Now you'll see the settings in multiple places. One is on the welcome screen. So once you've logged in, You'll see it at the top right where you'll see your current join settings and uh, your uh, share settings as well. And you'll be able to change that. Another thing you'll be able to see is your upcoming meetings for the next two days. And here you'll see which meetings are toggled on, meaning which meetings Fireflies will join as a note taker for. And you can disable it, uh, enable it. You can have it join all those scheduled meetings. Uh, that way you can have controls over which meetings Fireflies join. So that's the upcoming meetings module. You can also configure these join settings and share settings uh, in your settings tab. These are the individual settings tab in the settings section here. So on the left-hand navbar, I go to settings, and then I'll see these two options. Uh, another place where I can set this is in the team settings option. In the team, so I go to team, and then I click on settings, and then I'll be able to go here and configure these settings, not just for myself, but all my teammates. By default, as the admin of a workspace, um, I can have it set to allow teammates to choose. So that way each individual can choose on the team what settings they want. But if I want to enforce those settings, I can go here and force certain settings so that everyone has the same auto join settings and the email settings, right? So that's what it is. We're in the dashboard and I'm going to give you a quick tour. So this is a welcome screen. These are upcoming meetings that are on my list. I can enable them, disable them. Um, I have the options. And because I'm joined with my corporate account, I can see here join only internal events with Fireflies teammates or join only external events. I can pick those options. By default, I have it set to join all my calendar events. And then I have my uh, notes options here. I go to settings. I can see my join settings as well as my email, like no recap share settings. I can go to team and then I can go to settings here and I can go ahead and enforce the settings to for all my teammates if I would like, for my join settings as well as my recap share settings. So this is what the join and share settings are. Uh, and this is pretty much the bread and butter of how to use Fireflies and how to get the AI note taker bot to join your meetings.